It little profits that an idle king by this still hurt among these barren crags matched with his aged wife. I met in Dole, basically measured out, unequal laws into a savage race. That hoard and sleep and feed and not know me, or know not me. Wow, I said that backwards too. I cannot rest from travel. I will drink life to the leaks. All times I have enjoyed greatly, have suffered greatly, both with those that love me and alone, on shore and when through scudding drifts, the rainy Hades vex the dim sea. I am become a name for always roaming with a hungry heart. Much have I seen and known, cities of men and manners, climates, councils, governments, myself not least, but honored of them all, and drunk delighted, or delight of battle with my peers. Far on the ringing plains of windy Troy, I am a part of all that I have met, yet all experience is an arc where through, where through gleams that untraveled world where margins fade, and ever or forever and follow when I move. How dull it is to pause, to make an end, to rust unfurbished, not to shine in use. Basically, in other words, it's uh, faded, dull, uh, not clean. As though to breathe where life. Oh, as though to breathe were life. Life piled on life, were all too little, all of one to me little remains. But every hour is saved, for that eternal silence, something more, a bringer of new things, and vile it were. For some great sons to store and hoard myself, and this gray spirit yearning and desire, to follow knowledge like a sinking star beyond the utmost bound of human thought. This is my son, mine own Telemachus, to whom I leave the scepter in the isle. Well looked of me. Well looked of me. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Well loved of me, discerning to fulfill this labor by slow prejudice and make mild a rugged people, and through soft degrees subdue them to the useful and the good. Most blameless is he, Centered in the sphere of common duties, decent not to fail in offices of tenderness and pay. Meet adoration to my household gods, where I am gone. He works his work, I mine. There lies the port, the vessel puffs her sails. There gloom the dark, broad seas. The mariner souls that have toiled and wrought and thought with me that ever with a frolic welcome took the thunder and the sunshine and opposed free hearts, free foreheads, you and I are old, old age, hath yet his honor and his toil. Death closes all, but something ere the end, some work of noble note, may yet be done. Not unbecoming man that strove with gods, the light began to twinkle from the rocks. The long day wanes, the slow moons climb, the deep moans round with my voices. Come, my friends, it is not too late to seek a newer world. Push off, and sitting well in order smite. The sounding furrows for my purpose holds, to sail beyond the sunset, and the bass of all the western stars until I die. I may be that of the Gauls, will wash us down. It may be that the gulfs will wash us down. It may be we shall touch the happy isles, and see the great Achilles whom we know. Though much is taken, much abides, and though we were not, now that strength which in old days moved earth and heaven, that which we are, we are, one equal temper of, temper, yeah, one equal temper of heroic hearts. Made weak by time and fate, but strong in will to survive, to seek, to find, and not to yield. Alright, thank you so much for watching, and uh, yeah, there you go.